Welcome to GatehouseSupplies.com. We're taking a look at the LiftMaster 64LM 3-button mini keychain style remote control. This unit will work with LiftMaster, Chamberlain, or Sears garage door openers that were manufactured between 1984 and 1992 that have the 9 code switches or the yellow, gray, or white learning buttons. The part number on the circuit board that this unit works with will start off 41A3. This unit has three buttons. As I said, it's labeled 64LM on the back. To open the unit, simply remove the screw from the back panel and taking a small flat blade screwdriver, insert it in the little notch right above the key link and just pry the unit open. This will gain you access to the middle where you will see the nine code switches and the battery. Inside you'll find one set of dip switches that controls all three buttons. The way this works is you will set the code switches on your garage door openers. If you have, let's say you have three of them, you set all three units and the code switches in this remote control exactly the same. Then for the first garage door opener that you want to control with the main button on this unit, you'll set the code switches in the garage door, you'll set the number one switch to the minus position. On the second garage door, if you want to control that with the top button on this remote control, you'll set the number one switch in that garage door opener to the plus position. And to control the third garage door opener, which would work with the bottom button on the side of this unit, you would set the code number one code switch in that garage door opener to the zero position. The number one switch in this remote has no function, it is dormant. Everything is based on what you set your garage door openers for. Setting the code switches is easy. Simply take a screwdriver or a pen and move the switches up or down based on your code setting. Note there is a center middle zero position. Make sure any switches that are set in that position, make sure you're very careful and you get the switch in the correct position. It's not flopping over to the plus or the minus side. The unit comes with instructions or you can download them from our website and it will clearly state what we just described here about how to code them with the plus, minus, and zero setting for the number one switch. It's a 64LM. It's available at GatehouseSupplies.com.